Okay, we want to start. We are already late. Hope you refreshed a little bit from the cold air outside. And um, now we want to start the second session. And um, hopefully the weather will be like that and we'll have lunch soon there. So I want to, it's my big priv privilege and honor to invite Professor Menachem Fish, uh, the director of the Center of Religious and Interreligious Studies and uh, the owner of the Mazer, Ch Mazer? Mazer Chair for History and Philosophy of Science and a very distinguished scientist here in Tel Aviv University for many, many years. Thank you. Thank you, Mira. It's, it's, it's a special pleasure. It is a special pleasure. The Center for Religious and Interreligious Studies, which we're establishing at Tel Aviv, is dedicated to highlighting the crucially central role played by the way in which each of the three monotheistic religions at every important juncture in their lives responded and reacted tacitly, explicitly, consciously, unconsciously to their perceptions of the religion of the other two. And with in other words, the, way, the proper way to study religion is, is, is by taking that dialogical element in the life of the three religions into serious account. And therefore, it's a great, great pleasure uh, to share this specific session in this specific conference dedicated to Jesus among the Jews or Jesus and Judaism and the ways in which the perceptions of Christianity within Judaism develop. The, the panel today uh, has a very, very distinguished lineup. Uh, I'll introduce the speakers and papers in turn. One of them will be listening very, very closely to developments within Christianity in order to understand Judaism. The other will be listening very, very carefully to developments within Judaism in order to understand Jesus Among the Jews, and the third paper will be uh, uh, giving us a very interesting glimpse, as I understand, to the mediating language of Jewish Aramaic and the way in which Jesus figures there in the third paper. But before we continue, I'd like to invite uh, our second speaker today, Professor Martin Goodman from Oxford, to make a brief announcement. It really is brief, but it, it emerged over coffee. Uh, among the many colleagues uh, here in Tel Aviv and indeed from around Israel, uh, they're not, not all are aware that the Center for Hebrew and Jewish Studies, having moved its premises into the center of Oxford, remains extremely keen and enthusiastic to welcome visitors. Um, more than that, um, a good public occasion to be able to uh, inform people that we have research space within our new premises where visiting scholars who come to work in the Oxford libraries um, can come and be provided with um, such uh, research space um, and that we do hope that colleagues from Israel will go on coming to see us as often as they have in the past. 